guys, today is my game of The End Is Nigh. Uh, this is a platformer game that was released in 2017 and has been considered the spiritual successor of Super Meat Boy since it's made by the same developer. Um, yeah, I haven't really played much of this game, but I uh, have played Super Meat Boy and it is a very challenging game. And of course the graphics and everything of Super Meat Boy was very, uh, let's say it's kind of dated. <laughs> It's very flash-like, um, so yeah. What, I wonder if this game is, uh, you know, going to prove upon that. Probably more modern graphics and stuff. Let's try it. She dies alone. Okay, let's get this. Oh shit! Oh no! 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 Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh god! No, this can't be broke. Here, let me we get the <laughs> out. Uh, <laughs> oh no! It's still not working. Oh fuck! Fuck! What am I gonna do? Fuck! Oh, so much profanity. Okay. Dear. Okay. So yes, this game. Okay, the graphics first of all. In this game are much better than Super Meat Boy. <laughs> Super Meat Boy had this kind of like really flash style uh, mm -hmm. animation, which really reminds me kind of the, of the mid 2000s. But this game is uh, very, very modern like, I would say, uh, with much more polished graphics. And yeah, this controls similarly, I would say, to Super Meat Boy. Okay. Actually, does it? Can I stick to the balls, maybe? Okay, like that, yeah. Damn it. Same type of, uh, platforming action there, I guess. We have ledges we can stick on this thing. Instead of, uh, spinners and stuff, we have spikes. Instead of blades, we have spikes now.
involves a lot of careful timing and platform jumping and solving puzzles and stuff. Unlike Super Meat Boy, I can't exactly stick to the balls unless they have a hook on them. Can't stick on the balls. Yeah, I guess if you like the challenge of Super Meat Boy, you'll like this game. It, the, the graphics are better. Um, it's a little bit different, the mechanics. Like, uh, you don't stick to the side of the walls. Um, so it's still very very challenging. So, yeah, I would recommend this game for uh, people who like challenging indie titles, indie platformer titles. Like N++, if you like N++, or if you like uh, Super Meat Boy, you like this title. So, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching.